Hello everyone, today I'll show you how to connect to Amazon EC2 server using PuTTY in Windows. To do that, first download PuTTY. Just Google it, you'll find it easily. Now download this one, a Windows installer for everything except PuTTYTEL. I've already downloaded and installed it, so I'm not going to do it again. Now open Partisan. If you have uh, installed mm, the, the Party installer, you should have already Partisan installed on your PC. Now, if you are running uh, Amazon EC2 instance, then you should have a private key pem file that you have used during uh, uh, initializing your instance now load this uh, private key this is a pem file it's loaded and it's uh, then save it as a ppk file Okay. It's done now. Now log into your Amazon is to uh, Amazon console and click on security groups. Now uh, click on the first uh, uh, listed here. Click on inbound and click edit. Now you need to uh, add your IP address here because uh, for security reasons uh, Amazon doesn't allow uh, unknown IP addresses to connect to their server so you need to add your IP address here. Uh, to know your IP address is uh, easy just go to where is my IP.com it will show your IP address copy it add rule select SSH TCP 22 custom IP paste and then slash 32 I don't know what this 32 is but uh, you need to add it and then click save I've already added it so I'm not gonna add it again Now, one thing to mention here that uh, if you don't have a static IP, I mean, every time uh, you connect to internet, uh, the IP address changes, uh, then you need to add the new IP uh, to the security group in the Amazon console because the older ID will not work anymore. Uh, or you can uh, you can edit the older one because the older one. Uh, will no longer be used anymore so you can just uh, replace the IP from here to add new one okay now what uh, you need to do is open PuTTY and then in the host name uh, to get the host name click on the instances in your Amazon console get the instance you uh, are trying to connect then copy the public DNS yeah and here write your username is uh, the default username is ec2 dash user at the right and paste the public DNS now under connection expand SSH select auth and under private key file for authentication browse for the PPK file you just uh, generated from partition okay 
now open yeah this is now connected and you can run uh, the commands to control your uh, files and projects thanks everyone and if you have any advice or question you, you can comment on under this video thanks